This scenario presents an exploration of the 9-11 Commission report using the Jigsaw Visual Analytics System. Here, we treat each page of the report as a separate document in a collection. Entity identification first determines the people, places, and organizations mentioned throughout the collection. An analyst can explore lists of these entities by type. Sorting each entity list by frequency shows the most common entities of each type. Selecting an entity, such as Osama bin Laden, highlights in orange all entities co-occurring with him on some page. Darker orange indicates a stronger connection. Further sorting of a list by this connection strength brings the strongest connections to the top. Note the strong connections to different organizations, people, and locations. An alternate view of the collection represents each document as a small rectangle and clusters the documents by theme. Three keywords help communicate the topic of each cluster. Selecting an entity such as Bin Laden in one view highlights all documents it occurs in within the other views. Bin Laden is frequently mentioned in the clusters Interview 2004 FDNY and Attacks Operators Taliban. A graph view of the collection depicts entities as small colored circles and documents as white rectangles, all connected through network edges. Here we load and expand the Donald Rumsfeld entity node to show all the documents it occurs in. Expanding each of these documents in turn shows the entities within them. Let's focus on people and organizations then redraw the network to bring the most mentioned entities to the center. We see Bush, Hadley, and Cheney, as well as the White House, Pentagon, and Al-Qaeda. Next, let's load all the documents Rumsfeld appears in into a document view. Selecting a document from the list to the left shows its text to the right with entities highlighted. A word cloud at the top summarizes this entire subset of the document collection. Here, document 347 mentions a restricted national security meeting on the night of the attacks in which Rumsfeld urged the president and the principals to think broadly about who might have harbored the attackers, including Iraq, Afghanistan, Libya, Sudan, and Iran. We're interested in documents similar to this one, so we switch to the grid view of documents that provides a means to sort and color all the documents by their similarity to a selected one. Tooltips on each document then provide one sentence summaries of each. The most similar documents can be loaded into the document view to be read and explored further. Finally, a word tree view shows the context of a particular term in the collection. Here, the word Clinton. The most common words following Clinton in the collection are listed from top to bottom.